Good afternoon. I'm Dave Percy at the National Weather Service here in Anchorage, Alaska, and this is Friday's Alaska Statewide Weather. Low pressure in the Gulf of Alaska kept conditions uh, unsettled in areas from Kodiak Island up along the Kenai Peninsula with some scattered isolated showers over the inland areas of south central Alaska, mainly over the mountains and showers extended from the northern panhandle became a little more widespread over the central and southern southeast coast this all along an advance of a trough just coming onto the coastline late in the afternoon a uh, weak uh, system spread light rain across eastern Aleutians western Alaska Peninsula during the afternoon hours and winds were quite gusty out of the east northeast along the eastern Beaufort Sea coast with Kaktovik reporting gusts of 50 miles per hour today well Dead Horse had about 40 mile an hour gusts and Point Barrow 30 miles an hour with some light snow. About uh, one inch of snow fell at Nome, otherwise uh, rainfall amounts were generally light, but Sitka did pick up four tenths of an inch. For tonight, uh, look for isolated rain and snow showers, mainly over the mountainous terrain of uh, the south central Alaska area. Otherwise, skies will continue to clear over Kodiak Island, but winds will diminish uh, this evening after gusting possibly as high as 35 miles per hour in some locations. And then on Saturday, a weakening weather front will spread some light rain over the Alaska Peninsula, and showers will be seen behind the front uh, from the Pribilof Islands, and isolated showers over the eastern Aleutians become a little more widespread with a couple of troughs out over the central and western Aleutian Southern Bering Sea associated with the low just west-northwest of St. Paul. Otherwise, it will be partly mostly sunny from uh, all the Arctic coast north slope areas southward into Bristol Bay and Kodiak Island. And the outlook for Sunday, that uh, weak front will push inland and continue to weaken. Look for uh, areas of light rain and snow right along the frontal boundary from the Kuskokwim Valley up across Seward Peninsula, or up across St. Lawrence Island from the Yukon Delta. Showers over the Bering Sea and Aleutians with light winds. Light winds over the eastern north slope and dry conditions, and still a chance of showers over the southeast coast. While Kodiak Island will see light rain changing to showers in the afternoon, there's a chance of rain mostly southern Cook Inlet and the Kenai Peninsula. With Alaska Statewide Weather, I'm Dave Percy.